ಅಮೃತವಾಣೀ ಓ ಪ್ರೇಮವಾಣೀ ಓ ಪ್ರೇಮವಾಣಿ ಅಮೃತವಾಣಿ In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace and blessings of the Lord be always upon you. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, we are called to be witnesses of God. It is rather easy to witness God when everything is rosy, when everything is good, than to witness him in the circumstances that are like storms over our face. Yes dear brothers and sisters in today's first reading we see one of the most beautiful passages from the bible the passage in which we read about uh, the encounter of the faith phil daniel and the hungry lions the lion could not do anything to daniel they couldn't because he depended on god a god who was above everything a god who really loves and protects so dear brothers and sisters uh, in the gospel of today also we see what we see that jesus predicting about uh, the future he is saying that the end of the time will come the son of man will come when the earth will quake when everything will collapse and the end of time will come evaru nannu vadali pettina nenu ninnu vadalanu edabhayanu this is the promise of god let anybody let a mother forget the child she is feeding but i will never forget you no forsake you says the lord this is from the side of the lord but from our side can we tell to god evaru ninnu vidchi pettina nenu ninnu vidvanu na deva it won't be sandarbham lo it won't be aapad lo nenu ninnu vidvanu ಕಣ್ಣಿಲ್ಲೋ ಕಷ್ಟಾಲ್ಲೋ ದುಃಖಂಲೋ ದುರಿತಂಲೋ ನೀನು ನಿನ್ನ ಬಿಡುವನು ಐ ಆಮ್ ನಾಟ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಲೀವ್ ಯು ಗಾಡ್ ಆನ್ ಎನಿ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ವಿ ಸೇ ಲೆಟ್ ದಿ ಎಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಕಮ್ ಲೆಟ್ ದ ಥೌಸಂಡ್ ಫಾಲ್ ಬಿಸೈಡ್ ಮೀ ಟೆನ್ ಥೌಸಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಅರೌಂಡ್ ಮೀ ಬಟ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಮೂವ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಐ ನೋ ದಟ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಬಿ ಹಾರ್ಮ್ಡ್ ಸಮ್ ನೈನ್ ಟಿ ವನ್ ವಿ ಶಾಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಮೂವ್ we shall not move so let us pray dear brothers and sisters and if you really want to be that rock solid look at peter peter before his experience of denying the lord thrice and becoming rock solid after that after the spirit of god comes upon him he what he was he was simon simon means wavery shaky he made a journey from wavery simon to rock solid peter many of us may be wavery simons but we are not called to be wavery simons we are called to be rock solid peter god was not able to use the wavery simon how could he built his church on a wavery foundation on a shaky foundation he had to build his church on rock so for that to happen peter had to become a rock peter became a rock he stood strong so therefore god could work through him daniel did not shiver in front of the lions he was rock solid because he trusted in the lord the end of the world will come but will i be shaken will i leave in the church in the days of persecution somewhere in those 300 years first 300 years of the church 0 to 380 many persecutions happened and some persecutions were really severe and many left the church those who would have become 
saints by dying for Christ became worst sinners by leaving Christ. Leaving Christ and choosing life, not life in abundance, a life of this world. So, dear brothers and sisters, if we really want to rock, be rock solid like Daniel, if we really want to be people on stand strong in faith, we are supposed to be people who do not only believe but live the belief. We want to be people, those who really experience God and those who become the experience of God. For this to happen, it will never happen if we do not act. For this to happen, we have to live. We have to give our hundred percent to God. Are we ready? Are we ready? If we are ready, let's close our eyes. Lord, we are weak. You are strong. Make us strong. We are shaky. You are rock. Make us rock. We are unworthy. You are worthy. Make us worthy. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen.